All right, so this is Lion 500, the Legends of the Lion number, vlog number 30, 30, and this is summit number uh, 448. I almost forgot how many times I've done this. And this is Amy from the Diamond Works. Uh, diamonds are forever. Um, and she's actually wearing a few here. I just noticed that. Wow, you hike with the diamonds. It's amazing. I'm actually very impressed. <laughs> um, so, Amy. Tell us about what, why are you, why are you in this business? Why do you like diamonds so much? Why we love diamonds? Well, <laughs> <laughs> it's a kind of an impossible question because most ladies love diamonds. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think today just joining you on the summit, yeah. um, the team was really excited yes. to get out in Cape Town, and um, yeah, I think some of our, our team members didn't realise. How tough this, this little life. Well, you yeah. did very well though. Everyone yeah. got up. There was no complaints. Maybe one person saying how far. You've said that so many times. We're almost there. But but I mean that's that's the usual thing that hikers do to each other. We just mess with each other's brain. Yeah. But well done to everyone coming all the way up here. Especially uh, our, it's our camera lady's second time this week in a week. Well done, Andrea. <laughs> um, so uh, so. So, so if people wanted to come to you guys at Diamond Works, what would they have to do? Where would they find you? Well, we've, we've got five stores. Yeah. So we our flagship stores in Cape Town CBD, and then we mm -hmm. have a, a store in Windhoek, Namibia. Yeah. Um, and then two in the Winelands mm -hmm. in Cape Town. There's one in front, you go walk across. Stellenbosch. Cool. And oh, Tambo. But we're also about the experience. Yes. So um, we offer a sparkling tour and we share the history of diamonds in South Africa, um, diamonds um, history in Namibia and yeah diamonds obviously South African diamonds are considered the highest quality white diamonds in the world. Especially the cutting as well. Yes right? and the process so okay. the journey from mine to showcase so okay. it's, it's, a, it's a beautiful complimentary tour we open seven days a week and it's open to the public anytime. Awesome. Yeah. And do you guys have Tanzanite? It's incredible. Obviously with the celebration of South Africa, we can't ignore celebrating Africa and Tanzanite is considered a thousand times rarer than diamonds. Um, the essence of Africa mm. and we're the only demonstrating Tanzanite polishing studio in the Southern Hemisphere so yeah, it's, it's amazing to just compare the processes of diamond cutting versus hand and eye polishing. Cool. Yeah. So people can actually come and see how it's done. So, yes. Ah, it's cool. Yeah. So you don't necessarily have to buy the diamonds, you can come and look how it's done. And if you fall in love, buy it. Exactly, <laughs> the experience. Cool. Uh, so um, Amy and Andrea and the team here in Diamond Works, they actually were very, very generous enough to actually sponsor Line 500 and I'm very 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 grateful for that it was a huge boost in morale and also for um, the uh, the charities I mean it's getting us closer to our target which is going to be split between five charities of which is rape crisis the South African depression and anxiety group the Chimbera Rhino Fund the Wilderness Search and Rescue and Fallen Angels Pet Rescue so that's five different charities that are being helped out and if you're watching this, please drop us a like, drop us a comment, any activity would help. Uh, it's all going to work in the, uh, work for us and work for those charities. Um, so whatever you do, we're appreciating it. And please come and see Amy and the team. Um, Andrea, Andrea is also very friendly, don't worry, she's behind the camera because <laughs> she's very good at what she does. <laughs> um, so I wanted to ask you, Amy, we always ask our interviewees, what is your power track? What's the song that gets you on the dance floor? Good Lord. No, I'm a follower, so I kind of just follow the train. Hey, whatever's there, I'm, I'm stomping around to it. So, yeah, I, I can't No really artist, say. maybe it stands out for you? No, I'm a mellow person, so I guess... No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Okay, I, I, I told her Beyonce is, you know, yeah, it's okay. <laughs> See, what a guy. <laughs> All right, so, um, and then if you, if you could give anyone advice on the climb of Lion's Head, any 
you know, what, what would they have to do to get you? What kind of mindset would that be in? Join Costa. <laughs> <laughs> he gets you up. He gets you going. He's super patient. He's motivating. And the whole reason we're here today is, is because of Costa. Oh, thank you, no, we're here for the awesome. charities. Yeah, <laughs> Slide 500. That's, yeah, I mean, you, you, you campaigning that. So <laughs> thank you, awesome. I appreciate it. Yeah. All right, guys, thank you for everyone for watching and tune in next time. Uh, so, just so everyone who's watching this, the number 500 is going to happen on the 11th of February 2020. That is the same, that's almost uh, quite a big day because. It, in, um, on the 11th of February 1991, Nelson Mandela was freed from prison. So, there we go. He was a free man, long walk to freedom. That was a big day for everyone. His first speech that actually united the country. So, yeah, join us on the 500.